Could the real we see these books be rewritten? Let's get into it. This question stemmed from a Facebooker, Mark Baker, asking, with the rewriting of some of Roald Dahl's books to remove what appears to be considered by the publishers some offensive language, is the Railway series likely to be affected in a similar way? For anybody who's unaware, Roald Dahl's books were recently rewritten by the publishers because some of the terminology was deemed offensive by today's standards. This has rightly caused a bit of a debate around literature. Some people think that it should be left the way it is and not rewriting history in order to learn from those mistakes. The other side believes that it's probably best to rewrite these books so future generations don't use those offensive words in the future. And it was honestly something that I was thinking about, but I wasn't sure if the Thomas fandom wanted to hear my opinions. But clearly a lot of the fandom are thinking what I'm thinking, so I'm just going to give you my opinion anyway. For those worrying if the Railway series could be rewritten, it actually already has been. People in the loop of the Railway series books will know what I'm talking about, but for those that aren't, let me give you a little education. In the sixth book of the series, Henry the Green Engine, when Henry sneezed at those boys that were throwing stones at him and the coaches, the original print from the Reverend W. Audrey book said that the boys were as black as you get the idea. This rightfully caused a great deal of backlash, so much so that it was reported in the national press in 1972. Robert Audrey later apologised for the racist word that was used in the book, and it was changed for later publications to black as suit. This was rightfully changed, in my opinion, but it does prove that the Railway series books have already been tampered with. Again, I don't agree with the original word that was used, but when you take it into the context of the time that the book was written in, sadly, it was a common word even though I really don't agree with the using of that word. And because Wilbert was of a certain era, he didn't see anything wrong with using the word. Just like a lot of people don't see what's wrong with changing the role Dow books. Sometimes nostalgia can blind us and make us believe that things aren't as bad as they were. Which brings me to another point. There is an issue in one of the books that I really would like to see taken out. And it's in the book about Edward the Blue Engine. And the wording that I am not comfortable with was used in the final story of this book, Old Iron. Just click that both of the things that I have an issue with are in the final stories of each book. Again, for those that aren't in the fandom, the story of Old Iron is that James keeps making fun of Edward because he's old and should be scrapped. Two boys are on James's foot plate, fiddling with his controls, and it causes James to become a runaway, which then in turn leads to Edward having to catch up to James, bringing a shunter's pole and rope to wrap around his buffer so that they can check his speeds and get James's fireman to scramble over and take control of the runaway. In the TV series adaptation, you don't hear what happened to the boys that originally caused this incident, but in the Railway series book, you do, and it states, the two naughty boys were caught by the police, and their fathers walloped them soundly. Now, this is why that particular line gets to me. The dads have beat the crap out of their kids for doing that to James. Some will say, rightly so. But in the times we're living in now, it's not acceptable to physically assault your children. In Scotland, it's illegal. If anybody has watched one of my previous podcasts, That Mental Ginger Show, you know that when I wasn't well, I did strike one of my kids and I was removed from my family for six weeks as a result. And rightly so, I might add. I don't agree with hitting kids. A lot of people don't agree with hitting kids. I'm not against a smack on the hand if they're out of line, but walloping them soundly is not okay. But it was considered okay when this book was published in 1954. To this date, that line has not been edited out from the Railway series books, but I wouldn't be surprised if it eventually was. I know I'm taking it back to my personal experience, but when my kids were in hospital, they were in the neonatal unit, and we would go in every afternoon, and I would read them stories from the Railway series. I got to Old Iron, and I had completely forgotten that that particular phrase was used in the book, and I had to try and skirt past it, so that I could not put that in my young son's heads. And also so the nurses and my wife didn't hear it. I felt embarrassed by it. I later showed Alison 
the line in the Edward the Blue Engine book and told her about the line that was infamously cut from Henry the Green Engine. And she was so surprised that something like that was in kids' books. Which also brings us to the point that Thomas and Friends, and in particular the Railway series, is not meant to be just for kids, but we all know that. So do I think that the Railway series books will get tampered with again? Quite possibly. And not just for the Edward the Blue Engine line. A lot of people don't like that Sir Topham Hatt is called the Fat Controller. I did a video on this, you can check it out. And I wouldn't be surprised if later publications eventually removed the Fat Controller altogether and just referred to him as Sir Topham Hatt. I think it depends on what side of the fence and what times you're living in that will decide what is edited out of books or any media in the future and what isn't. It's why a lot of people don't like digital media, because you can alter it and you don't have original copies anymore. And that's why so many people still love physical media, especially since Mattel were starting to take all the Thomas episodes down. Because as much as I don't like the line from Henry the Green Engine, and I am glad it was removed, I am still curious to see an original book from back then, just so I could see it with my own eyes. The curiosity will always get the better of you. I personally think that we shouldn't edit any more of the books, even the line that I don't agree with in Edward the Blue Engine. If you don't agree with it, just do what I did and don't say it. Find a way around it. Again, if you don't like the fact that the Fat Controller is called the Fat Controller in the books, when you're reading them to your kids or reading them to anyone, just don't say the Fat Controller. Call them Sir Topham Hat. Humans can always change themselves to be better and censor themselves to adapt to the times. But we still need to have the original literature and the original media to remind us all how much times have changed how we've evolved, and that we know we will never make those mistakes again. So that's my thoughts on the Railway series books, and how I believe that they should not be edited, although there is every likelihood that someday they could be. I'd love to know your thoughts on it. Do you think it should be edited? Should we leave them the way they are? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and until next time, keep on chugging!